Trump just got ultimate revenge on Lindsey Vonn who trashed him she could be out of Olympics. The last 48 hours have been particularly rough for Olympic alpine skier Lindsey Vonn. Ever since she decided to use her public platform to slam our president, she's suffered the recourse of that really bad decision. She should have learned from the immense fallout in the NFL but refused to. Now. Donald Trump has just gotten the ultimate revenge on the athlete who could be forcibly removed from the 2018 Olympics. Her goals of coming home with another gold medal have just been shattered by her own doing and it didn't take too long to realize the ramifications. It's strange how athletes have no problem using Trump to bring attention to themselves by making such bold public statements for how much they hate him. What's even odder, is that they never seem to learn their lesson and can't stop themselves from slandering him, regardless of the massive ramifications. The latest victim of the stupidity is Vaughn who just got what she earned when she opened her mouth and said, well, I hope to represent the people of the United States, not the president, according to CNN. Less than 24 hours after a boycott of her sponsors was initiated, Vaughn suffered a bigger, devastating blow. Reuters reports, American Lindsey Vaughn was injured after finishing the World Cup Super G race and street murders on Saturday while Switzerland's Lara got crashed halfway down the course. Vaughn, four times overall World Cup champion and the finest woman skier of her generation, fell to the ground grimacing as she slowed down after the finishing line and she staggered away with what appeared to be either a hip or back injury. Vaughn spent just under an hour in the medical treatment tent before being escorted to a waiting car and driven away. The 33-year-old walked a few meters to the car with great difficulty. An ambulance was initially called but was not needed. The U.S. team said on Twitter that Vaughn compressed her back on the fifth gate, skied through pain but didn't have the power to push. She was evaluated by the physio and doctor in the tent. Further information to come. It's an unfortunate injury that could prevent her from participating in the Winter Olympics, which some are seeing as nearly instant karma for coming out and attacking Trump in her initial interview. Vaughn is no stranger to pain and recovery, having just spent the last couple of years rehabilitating, training, and getting in condition for this Olympic competition after enduring major injuries from her last race.